where would negative 17 sixths or negative 17 over 6 go on this number line? And for me, I like to think of it as a mixed number. So with the way I like to think about it, this is the same thing as negative 17 divided by 6. And so you can rewrite it as negative 17 divided by 6 is the same thing. Well, 6, I, we can do it over here. 6 goes into, well, we could say 6 goes into 17 and then add the negative later. We're going to get a negative value here. But 6 goes into 17 two times. Let me write that 2 in a new color. It goes into 17 exactly two times. And then 2 times 6 is 12. You subtract 17 minus 12, you get 5. So you end up with the remainder 5. So negative 17 divided by 6, this is going to be negative 2. A negative divided by a positive is a negative. Negative 2, and then a remainder of 5. So it's negative 2 and 5, negative 2 and 5, 6. So all I've done is I've converted this improper fraction into a mixed number. And now that makes it easier for me to plot. So when I plot it, let me make sure what each of these little, each of these little marks are. So if I have 1, 2, 3 marks, I'm at negative 3. 1, 2, 3 marks, I'm at positive 3. So each of these must be 1. So this must be 1, 2. This should be negative 1, negative 2. So we're going to go negative 2 and 5, 6. So this is, so let's keep, this is negative 1. Then we keep going. We go to negative 2. Now we have to go another negative 5, 6. So that's almost another negative 1. So it's another negative 5, 6. It's going to get us right about, right about there. I could actually do a bunch of hash marks. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and then 6, 6 would be a whole 1. So negative 5, 6 would be 5 of these, which is once again right over there. So negative 2 and 5, 6 puts us right over there. That's where I'd place it.